Hello Galaxy Heroes, uh, this is my alt account, um, I've been asked a few times recently about him, so him, my alt account, whatever, um, so this is 18th of June's uh, Grand Arena Championship round one, um, and I believe I captured all the battles, so this was kind of one of the toughest ones, it's a, it's a relict Grievous, so he's going to be problematic. Um, not all, so in gear wise or whatever. Uh, Jedi Knight Revan is Relic 2, Relic 3, um, and then Bastilla, Jolie, and GMY are all gear 12, and I believe my Hermit is. Gear 9, gear 10, it's not very highly geared. Um, fortunately, lots of foresight and everything normally protects him. He's pretty sturdy even at a low gear level. So, yes, so we've managed to break through and now obviously all we do is jipping away at the B1. Um, was it seven, seven bits each hit? 17, or oh, 16, done, 58, Pwah. So I needed to see what was behind thing, and of course, okay, so this one, um, spoiler alert, so I'm going, as you can see, gear 12 Treya, gear 12 Cyan, gear 11 Nihilus, gear 12 with Zeta Dooku, and a very low geared uh, Sith Trooper, um, and it started off bad and kind of got worse. Um, yeah, Dooku did not last at all. Uh, I was quite surprised at that, to be honest. So, lesson to be learned there. Always check them out. I mean, the only good thing here is, as you can see, they're all on kind of like one red dot now. So, just want any AOE or whatever, and we're going to have the lot. Boom, done. Um, so, points tally uh, greatly reduced. We lost two, so 52 points there. However, wins a win. Open up the back. Get to see what's there. Uh, it's not too bad, so go up to the top. So the next one that was really troubling me here is the Padme. And as you can see, Yorkie has got a couple of Siths. And then uh, we play around and... Who are we throwing in there? I'm playing around because I think I'm going to... Oh, I think I'm it. Yeah, so in goes... I was going to put in Gene Ocean Brood Alpha and then it's like, nah, I can't do that because I want to use him. So I throw in my Gear 11 Vader, um, who I had double zated just before the beginning of this. Uh, I had some foolish notions of possibly being, Yorkie being in a position to go for uh, Jedi Knight Luke, but no, that's not going to be... Uh, achievable um, yeah low bot alone would prevent so doing all right here I've got getting rid of mm, the main damage dealers um, go on bye bye snips yeah so okay so it's not the cleanest of battles Vader really did take some lumps there but the 55 yes moving on so we've got uh the bounty hunters um yeah um so this is where i'm gonna make some ground up hopefully and uh yeah the uh relic chewy and han oh my oh my such such a useful thing so so such a, a, a i mean just a they are the trio in themselves aren't they i mean you've got the triumvirate of uh ujimi flip Darth Treya and uh, uh two sif chumps chums but um this is the light side triumvirate isn't it not much is getting through that look at that 61 points lovely jubbly that kind of made amends on the uh the dropped banners earlier and Okay, so also left me <clears throat> banging these in, so having to relict 
Galactic Republics is quite handy. Uh, should should make pretty short short work of these. So one down, two down. Look at that. <laughs> she's I think she's gear nine or gear ten, Barris. But just the you know all the additions of what Padme brings, and you saw the level Padme is. I mean, she's not exactly high, but. Yay, so uh, I've got the shippy whips there, and so I've got these two here to, to round off, I um, think if I remember rightly we're going to go G and Oceans on one, yeah there you go, I should know shouldn't I, so recently um, got my soldier to relic level as well, this is working guild wise towards uh, being able to contribute better, you know, to uh the the g and ocean the dark side g and ocean tb but they, they're just so good i mean this okay this this is kind of using a sledgehammer to crack a walnut there but it was like no i want full banners um and then i do a stupid one here and yeah, I should have gone. I've, <clears throat> in hindsight, I should really have gone with my bounty hunters, because they would give the chance for uh, four banners. Um, but I didn't. Yeah. In fact, I went full clone rather than even going shack lead. But yeah, it is what it is. It's a bit of fun. Yeah, it's nice to actually be able to use a a full um, clone squad. Especially on on the Yorkie account, so Yorkie has been working quite high, as you see. Uh, Rex, Rex, Echo, and Fives are all relic level. Um, Arc is twelve and a half gear, twelve and a half. I'm working on his bits, but I'm also having realizing that there's other bits I want to do. So for Yorkie, for example, to unlock Malik. Um, I need to boost up my old Republic, so I've been doing a bit of that. So, yeah, the gear is kind of being shared around, and I'm still only six star C3PO, so as a hindrance, obviously, that's going to prevent me accessing gas. But here we go into the final one. So, yeah, got to go with the Neg, uh, strongest fleet, and then, um, yeah, I'll go short on this. So, this gives me a second. Uh, undersized squad battle and away we go big bada boom coming up only two of them but look at that i think do i call it yeah i i'm, I'm brave and like let's go for as many banners as we can so 63 banners there um so total of 1916 i can let you know that it was very close and uh yeah i cocked up on here i went back to one too many but my opponent fair play to him um very close he he or well, they posted a 1912 so yay first battle down first win for yorkie and that's my gag. Thank you for watching.